Hey everyone, today, we're exploring a fascinating discovery about the moon's barely there atmosphere. While the moon might seem like a lifeless rock, it actually has a very thin, delicate atmosphere called an exosphere. The scientists from MIT and the University of Chicago have just uncovered how this mysterious atmosphere is formed and maintained. Let's break down what this means and why it's such a big deal. Welcome to Trend Storm. Chapter 1. What's an exosphere? First things first, what is an exosphere? Unlike Earth's thick, breathable atmosphere, the Moon has an exosphere, a thin layer of atoms that bounce around the surface. It's so thin that it can't support life or even protect against space radiation. But the real question has been, what creates this delicate atmosphere? For a long time, scientists suspected that space weathering, like solar winds or impacts from meteoroids, could be responsible. But now, thanks to cutting-edge research, we have a much clearer answer. Chapter 2. The Discovery. Meteorites Shape the Moon's Atmosphere. The team at MIT and the University of Chicago studied lunar soil samples collected during NASA's Apollo missions, and they found that the Moon's exosphere is primarily the result of meteorite impacts. Over the Moon's 4.5 billion year history, it has been hit by countless meteorites, first by massive ones in its early years and more recently, by smaller micrometeoroids. Every time these meteorites hit the lunar surface, they vaporize atoms on impact, kicking up particles into the thin atmosphere. Some of these atoms get ejected into space, but others stay suspended over the moon, maintaining the exosphere in a delicate balance. Chapter 3. The Main Process, Impact Vaporization this process is called impact vaporization, and it's been happening for billions of years. The constant bombardment of meteorites vaporizes the lunar soil, releasing atoms into the atmosphere. The study's lead author, Nicole Nee from MIT, explains that this is the dominant process forming and sustaining the lunar atmosphere. About 70% of the Moon's exosphere is the result of these meteorite impacts. The other 30%? That comes from something called ion sputtering, where solar winds, those charged particles from the sun, hit the moon's surface and kick up atoms. But make no mistake, meteorite impacts are the real driving force behind the moon's atmosphere. Chapter 4. NASA's LADEE mission. A closer look at the atmosphere. To get to the bottom of this mystery, scientists also relied on data from NASA's LADEE mission. LADEE, which stands for Lunar Atmosphere and Dust Environment Explorer, orbited the Moon in 2013 and gathered key data on the Moon's exosphere. While LADEE confirmed that both meteorites and solar wind influence the atmosphere, the recent study has shown that impact vaporization plays a much bigger role than previously thought. Chapter 5. Why is this important? So, why does this matter? Understanding the Moon's atmosphere gives us critical insight into its history and how space weathering shapes other planets and moons in our solar system. The more we learn about the Moon, the better we can understand similar processes on moons and asteroids elsewhere in space. Plus, this research highlights how important it is to bring samples back to Earth, just like the Apollo astronauts did. These samples give us the data we need to paint a clearer picture of how the solar system evolved. This discovery helps us understand a long-standing mystery about the Moon and opens up exciting possibilities for future lunar exploration. Source. Massachusetts Institute of Technology. If you found this as fascinating as we did, don't forget to hit that like button.
subscribe to Trend Storm, and let us know in the comments, what do you think is next for lunar exploration? Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more exciting discoveries in science and space.